Well, we got it left here. We done paid five dollars down on it. Amos, we is now in the taxi cab business. The pressure taxi cab company. I don't know if we ought to get incorporated today or wait a few days. But tell me this, will it help us any if we get that done to us? Well, if we get incorporated, we has always got the corporation behind us. Uh, what do you mean we got the corporation behind us? Well, here's the automobile. Yeah, here's the automobile. I agree with you there. There it is, right there. Now, the next thing we is going to do is go into taxi cab business. Suppose we has accidents. If we is incorporated, we don't have to worry. Let the corporation work. That's the advantage of doing that. Well, that's a good idea, all right. I guess we ought to get incorporated. Just think, Amos. Here we is in Chicago. Mm-hmm, we's in Chicago. We ain't been here but about six weeks, and already we has got all the mobiles. What would the boys down in Atlanta say if they could see us up here with our automobiles? That certainly would be something, though. Mm -mm. But the only trouble is, I wish the car had a top on it. That's what it would. There you go now. You're trying to ruin the whole thing. What do you suppose I named the company the Fresh Air Taxi Cab Company for? If we had a top on the car, that would kill the whole idea. People can get in this taxi cab and sit there in the sunshine out in the air. That is one of the greatest things that has ever been revented, what I've just done here. Oh, I, I, I agree with you there already. Well, here we is now. We has got the automobile. The next thing is moving it in. Now, I'm going to repoint you as the chief mechanic's mate. You has charge of all the machinery. You get everything in working order, and then I'll respect it and see if it's all right. Well, the first thing we've got to do is to get it off this lot, ain't it? The first thing we ought to do is ride around the block in it and see if everything's all right, yeah. That's what we ought to have done before we bought it, I guess. There you go now, finding fault again. I ain't finding fault. I just said that I thought we ought to have tried it out before we bought it, that's all. Is the gasoline tank got any gasoline in it? Well, Mr. Jarvis said that it had about a half a gallon of gasoline in it. A lot of the rain then got in the gasoline tank, though. There's some water in there now. Well, there's our idea right there. What's that? We can mix a little water with the gasoline. We ain't got to feed this car pure gasoline. Well, water and gasoline mix? If you get it in the bottle and shake it up, it'll mix, sure. I wonder if the car got any oil in it. Flip up the hood there. Let's take a look at it. Wait a minute. Where's the oil place on here that you put oil in? Lay the top back down there now so you ain't going to drop it on me. Lay it down. That's the stuff. What are these two holes here? Is that where you put the oil in? Them holes there is for the spark plugs. We are short two spark plugs. She ain't hitting on but two cylinders. She ain't hitting on none yet, is she? She ain't hitting on nothing yet. Well, we can run the thing on two cylinders, and after we get it going, we get enough money to buy a couple of more spark plugs. I wonder where you find out about this your oil thing. The thing must have some oil in it. Well, if you think it's got it in there, then we'll just forget about the oil thing. Ain't no use to worry about the oil. The thing we've got to do now, it's got to have oil in it. Automobiles can't run without oil, and they run the thing up here where it is now. And oil don't evaporate, so there must be some still in there. Well, look here. Wait a minute here. Here's something down on the ground here. Wait a minute here. What is you getting from under the car there now? What is that? Well, look here. Here's a great big cog wheel that done fell out here on the ground with some bolts and nuts. Look here. It done fell out on the ground. That thing didn't come out the car, did it? Well, he was telling me something about the bottom of the car when I looked under there once. I forget what it said. Oh, I remember what he said now. He said that the, uh, that it didn't have no dustpan under there. So we can go to five and ten cents store and get a dustpan. The best thing to do, though, instead of dusting the car off, is to get a wet rag and wipe it off. Wait a minute, I'll look under there again. You see anything else under there? No, I don't see nothing else under there. I'm going to get back up. Wait a minute, Joe. No, I, I wonder where these here great big cog wheels done come from, though, with these here bolts and all this stuff. That couldn't come out the motor. The motor is cracked, you know. It's got a great big crack running right across the top of it. Wait a minute. Let me get in this driver's seat here. Go ahead. What's the matter? Won't that door open? 
Well, I be doggone. The door is nailed shut. I wonder if the door in the back seat is the same way. If it is, we gotta cut a hole through there so the people can get in already. See if you can open the back door there. Pull hard, pull hard. One side will open, but this other side is stuck. Look here, it won't open. Pull on the thing. I'll pull it. Look, look out there. Look at you now. Look at you. Look I'll at that. I've been doggone. I done pulled the door off the hinges in it. What are you trying to do? Pull the car to pieces? We just got the thing, and now you're trying to break it up. Well, you told me to pull on the door, though. That's what you told me to do. Lay the door in the back seat now. There's something else we got to fix. Let me step over the front door now and get in the driver's seat here. Go ahead now. Sit down in the driver's seat there and see how it feels. Wait a minute here. I can't get my knees down under this thing. What's the matter there? You kind of tangled up there, ain't you? Wait a minute. Come up here. Help me. I got my foot here tangled up with the emergency brake. Wait a minute here. Wait a minute. I'll pull your foot out. Ow. Don't bend my foot around like that. Unleash the brake. Unleash the brake. It must be stuck. So is my foot. Take off the clutch or something. What do you mean? Take it off the automobile? Unleash it. Unleash it. Everything is unleashed. My foot ain't unleashed. Can't you see how the thing is stuck in there? Here, now wait a minute. Come here. Put your hand under my knee there. Now pull it up. Up. That's the stuff. I've a dog gone. I done pull your shoe off. Look at that. Mm-mm. Oh, don't reach down there now and get my shoe out of that mess. Wait a minute, yeah. I'll get it for you. Wait a minute. You, you, you got to be kind of careful about that thing, dude. I don't see how I'm going to drive this car unless I hang my feet over the side while I was driving. Yeah, slip that shoe on my foot now, Amos. Hold still here. If you had some feet in your socks, your foot would go on there better. That's enough, that's enough. Now, wait a minute. Let me see here now. Where is the remission? What are you looking for? A switch that turns on the remission. Uh, what is this your thing? Wait a minute, let's see. What is that? L-I-G-H. Oh, that's light. That's what that is. Get up front now when I switch this and see if the lights go on. Go Wait on. a minute now. It ain't a, it ain't no use to switch that on because it ain't no globes in the headlights. What you mean? Ain't no bulb in the thing? That's right. It ain't no bulb in the thing. The wires are hanging off up here. Well, watch it anyhow. See if anything happens. I'm going to turn it on now. Here it goes. Anything happen? Ain't nothing happened yet. Switch it on again. I'll turn it back now. See if they go out. There it is. Did they go out? Uh, they ain't been on yet. Well, that needs fixing. Uh, you want to try it again? I'll watch it if you want me to. No, no, wait a minute. There ain't no use to wear yourself out watching that. See if the daylight goes on when I switch this thing. Well, wait till I get back there now. Did it go on? Ain't no daylight on here. See any wires sticking out anywhere back there? No, the, the fender's got a hole in it back here. You can hang a red light on there if you want to hang one of them oil lamps on here. Wait a minute. Here's a switch. Here's a starting switch. Here, come here. See here? It says S-T-A-R-T, start. Well, well, what is you going to do now? Is you going to start the car running now? Now, wait a minute. I'm going to throw this on start and see what happens. You better get ready to cut it off right quick in case you start running. Look out now. I'm going to throw it over on start. There she is. What happened? Wait a minute. I heard something. What did you hear? Wait a minute. I hear something under the car. See what's here, sir. Look here. There's another car wheel that done fell out. What kind of mess is this? I don't know. Look here. The Let whole thing is falling to pieces here. Look here, man. Look here.